So back to this perform and recover mantra uh, and our obsession in the biohacking space with doing things like uh, continuous glucose monitors and regulating your glucose as tightly as possible. And the more regulated it is, the better. Somehow we've gotten out of control with this kind of thinking where we, we feel like a glucose spike is inherently a bad thing. And a glucose spike is not inherently a bad thing. A glucose spike occurs when, for example, you are asked to perform a high intensity workout or when you consume a substantial amount of calories at a meal. The glucose spikes, the insulin comes into the bloodstream. Remember that insulin is delivering nutrients throughout the body to uh, muscles and tissues that need it. And so insulin is an extremely important, uh, it's, they, they call it an anabolic hormone, but it's, the, the truth is it's an anti-catabolic hormone, but it's the same thing. It helps build your body back and recover from stress, especially of exercise and the simplified example of insulin delivering uh, glucose into the, uh, the, the muscles and the liver to restock depleted glycogen from your challenging workout.